We are at Gamble Pavilion, where once again the fans lined up early to get the best seats in the house. It's a second round matchup between UConn and Syracuse as we welcome you to the NCAA Women's Championship presented by Capital One, another packed house with the face mask. Was out for two weeks, missed the last two games of the Big East Tournament. She is back and came back with a vengeance. Freshman gets her first start since mid-November. That's because Elena Rice, who usually starts at a guard spot, is out, suffered a concussion in their win against Arizona and the usual starting five for UConn. Yeah, that's so tough because Rice played over 30 minutes. She has grad transfer experience as well. Great start. For UConn, it's KK Arnold. Her shot was not falling, and Coach Jack was on her saying, hey, we need you, especially without the services of Rice, who averages 10 a game. I think she got that message. Beckers forces a turnover. Nika Mule, the very talented point guard. Beckers with some flash. Just not Edwards. She saved herself a couple feet and maybe a blocked shot by pulling up there right inside the elbow. Good drive by K.K. Arnold. That was just a tough bucket. There's a transfer from Michigan. Willie Floater. Edwards gets it. Arnold. Becker somehow was able to collect it. Well, she didn't get a good clean. And get an assist. Oh, boy. But then... The... Syracuse on top. This is how UConn was working against the zone during their practice. Get it into the high post area and work out from there. Ashley Shade, the freshman, coming off a career. And Edwards had lost Verjao right there. If she had been able to handle it, she probably could have scored easily in there. Beckers with a nice feed from Mueller. That's what you do. Take those shallow cuts against the zone right there at the Big East. Two-point game against Arizona. The most points any Orange player has ever scored in the NCAA tournament game. She was outstanding, and she only took six shots in the first half on Saturday, and she scored 11 straight by herself in the fourth. Ashland throwing some shade again. She Four blocks already for the Huskies, and in this NCAA tournament full of stars, we have one here in DeAsia Fair. Shade again! Her third three of the game. She was nice at first, then made field goals. Well, Syracuse can't settle for the shots that UConn is giving them. They need to take their shots. Beckers with the floater. Coach Jack has an area right there. She may be diminutive on the outside, but she is a monster on the inside. That stops a 13-0 UConn run. Beckers thought about it, then got inside. Tremendous bounce pass over to Edwards. Beckers and Edwards are always on the same page. Checks back in. A temple transfer. Edwards gets it over to Shade. Beckers. First offensive board, and she converts. Lisa Page. There's some extra defensive attention to the basketball right now that Syracuse is showing. Inside Beckers. Turn, shoots, hits. And if we look at the shot chart in this first possessions for Syracuse, and give UConn credit for getting a body on and maintaining contact to disallow those extra possessions. Beckers elevates. <laughs> oh, wait. The shot clock is off. The fans stand, and Beckers looks at Gino. He said, go. She does, and she hits it. Paige Beckers with... <laughs> UConn up by 11. That has been it offensively. In, in that first half, UConn turned it over five times, but Syracuse was able to score 10 points off as Paige gets a nice dime there. 
Well, after the timeout. There, but Ragnika Mule just had quick hands there to take it away and deflect it. Eckers goes behind her back, floats it over to Shade. UConn with a nice response. Phenomenal spacing and pain. At practice, you know Ariema said, you've got to be in the picture. If you can't see the camera, you're not going to be in the picture. Nobody was in the picture there defensively. What a quick move by Beckers. 25 points. Fair right there behind her on her heels. Phenomenal. So two of the top four scorers in the history of women's college basketball are playing in the NCAA tournament. Arnold with the bucket, not just playing in the tournament, but you're going to get to see Caitlin after this. Decker's working on Woolley, kicks it out. Shade from the corner. Ashlyn Shade just beats the buzzer to get the lead back up to nine to take on Duke in Portland in the Sweet 16. Duke pulling off the upset of Ohio State. Yesterday, and more to Christy Winner-Scott joining you. Paige Becker is hitting the shot. UConn missed its first six shots with their zone, and you see Aaliyah Edwards right there creeping around the nail. Once she gets it there, she can go to work. Puts it in with her offhand. Well, it gives you options when you to stay right in this game. There was five of seven from distance. Starting today for Rice, out with the concussion. You saw a little bit of daylight, then kicks it out to Paige Beckers. Paige has 30. Allen's on that one. Still tried to have the flick of the wrist. And now they're trying to blitz a little bit, and we saw that towards the end of that first half. Shade again, that's her spot. Hit one there at the end of the third quarter and just got another. Kyra Wood now has four fouls. Stays out there for the orange. Shade. Ashley Shade has been magnificent this weekend. Syracuse run. Most of the fans that sold out Gamble are on their feet. Beckers, little hesitation and hits. Big time players step up into one. Accentuating how important she has been to them. Still a one possession game, so Syracuse is not fouling. Smart. Beckers. Over to Arnold. Got it to roll in. True freshman. And she has just been a stalwart of strength. So a brilliant career from the Asia Fair ends tonight in stores. UConn will take on Duke in Portland. Gino and Coach Jack, mutual admiration society tonight. The Asia Fair pass both Jackie Styles and Kelsey Mitchell, now third all time in points. And we will see UConn out west to take on Duke. What a fight it was for Syracuse. Down a dozen at one point and just came up a little bit short. So for Christy Winter Scott and our entire ESPN crew, I'm Pam Ward as we say so long. Thank you, DeAsia Fair. Great, great career. Let's get you to Iowa City.